This is EdTech Moment, where we take just a moment to show you how to quickly integrate technology into your classroom. EdTech Moment is brought to you by Audible.com. Visit audibletrial.com slash edtechmoment to get your free 30-day trial with thousands of books that are awesome. This episode of EdTech Moment is about the brand new TED-Ed. It's still in beta, but we're going to take a look at the first draft that TED-Ed has for us where you can create your own lesson plans around YouTube videos. Let's take a look. Hi, welcome back to EdTech Moment. I'm Bill Selleck. Let's take a look at EdTed, TED-Ed, however you want to say it. Uh, it's ed.ted.com, but they refer to it as TED-Ed. It starts off with all of these pre-made presentations for you. Featured is the best way to get to know the site. Once you look at all the different featured articles and videos and lessons, you can look at it by series, which is really nicely organized if that's what you're looking for. If not, probably just jump into your subject. And it's all pretty intuitive. The TED Ed video does a great job. What I'm excited about is actually creating your own YouTube flipped lessons. So with this, I'm going to search for Video Killed the PowerPoint Star. This is a recent music video I made. I already have it uploaded. Yes, this is the one I want. I'm going to flip this video. So by default, it gives us this title. My lesson description's here. I'm going to just be going back and forth. Here's my description I've already typed out. So I've already thought about this ahead of time. So I can just paste in the lesson description. There's four parts to it when you make your own. You don't get to do the quiz, but you can have other sections. The watch is just watch the video. Here's the think section with our own questions. This is just short response. They don't get to click four choices, but it's just a way that you can get quick responses. So here's question number one, and just click add. So I can create another question, and just paste that in, and add. So again, the watch section, here's my video. Under think, here are my two questions. Question number one, and you can see there's a box right on here they could fill this in. Question number two, dig deeper is where they prompt you to have just more. So here is what I think students should get out of it. I can also add a link to it, either here or at the very end. Let's do that at the end. So at the very, very end, we could, um, I didn't type anything out. We could just say, um, now it's your turn to make your own epic slideware presentation. Become a, you know it, PowerPoint star. Wow. We can preview it, see what that's going to look like. So students would see it looks like this. Watch. Here's my questions. Question one, question two. Dig deeper, here's information I gave them. And then finally, let's just leave it the way it is and click publish. It gives us a unique URL so we can share that with our students. And let's look at what this lesson looks like from a student perspective. There's the watch section so they can watch the video. When I click on think, you can see that lines up with those two questions I had. Dig deeper is going to give them more information. When I click next section, it gives me the part that's same as and finally. So that's what the flipped lesson looks like when you take a YouTube video and run it through TED Ed. Visit us at edtechmoment.com for more amazing videos. You can also tweet at us. We are at EdTechMoment. Anytime you have a question, comment, or suggestion, you can always email us the old-fashioned way, feedback at EdTechMoment, or you can reach me, Bill, at EdTechMoment.com. Thanks for taking just a moment.